see if I know any moves. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Where have you run so fast? <laughs> oh my god. Dad put truffle sauce on my salad yesterday. Is that what I could smell in the house? Yeah. See that what happens when I'm not there to manage? You're kind of a helicopter mom. What makes me, give me some examples of what make me helicopter mom. So I can This work conversation. Out. How's school going? Here, do you like the black and white ones? I want to cook for you. Should we talk about your laundry a little bit? So why do you lock your door? Um. Can you imagine if I didn't helicopter though? Yeah. What do you think you would be thinking? That I was free. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love your turquoise jewelry. These are fun. So everything here is vintage turquoise. How much is this one? Let's see, this one right here comes out to 2200 I'm gonna buy this. Absolutely. I might buy that necklace too. Hi. You got it, girl. Hi. Oh my gosh, you look so cute. How I are you? Have you been in here? a sushi bar. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I just, chemo sounded Japanese to me, and I thought that sabi was just like a play on wasabi. Would you ladies like uh, to step into the bar? Yeah. Yes, we'd love to go to the bar. Follow me. <laughs> Regardless, I've been waiting to eat all day, and now I'm starving and surrounded by hats. Oh my gosh, is this a secret? <gasps> I love secret passageways. <laughs> I love this. Welcome to heaven. I feel so like Can we get you guys, what do you guys want to drink? You know what? I would love a spicy margarita. Absolutely. I'll do that too. I just love this whole vibe. And see, look how cool their hats look. But do you know what this is? What, what is a rattlesnake? That? That's a raccoon penis. Wait, let me see. What? Let me no, see. No, there's too much. Why? Okay. Yeah. I don't want to see any Wait, where sort is of it? penis. This is a raccoon penis. penis. That's really so small. Wrong. It has never even come into my mind that raccoons have a penis. Like, I'd like to live in the world where they don't have penises and they're not on hats. Like, who comes up with this stuff? I missed you on the trip. Like, I didn't like being there without you. I've never felt so. It felt like, like that. super bad for me. We heard a totally different story from Bronwyn about what? Why I wasn't about there? About why you weren't there? I would love and to she hear what saying, she said. What did she? What was her? Well, she was saying version. she really wishes you were there. Like, she invited you to her home, but you said she was venomous, and it didn't go well. Heather also dropped some bombs in there, like, I'm two-faced, and I'm conniving, and I'm mean. And when you left, she was in tears. So I feel like it made things really uncomfortable, especially yeah. when I called you from the hot tub. When Bronwyn came out, she was livid well, over hey, you. Let's like, put a pin in it. Yeah. She got mad that you called me, but she said she cried that I wasn't coming, and she's sad that I wasn't there. It didn't there. make any sense to me. I was so shocked that Bronwyn had such a big reaction. Like, because she's confusing and, and nothing she, she says like, tracks. Oh, and then get this. So after we leave the hot tub, Bronwyn and Todd are in the bar. And he's like to John, like, if Lisa doesn't fix things with Bronwyn, you guys basically need to go. What did Todd just say to you? He just said Bronwyn's real upset. And he said, if it can't be settled out, then he wants us to go. Like, right. leave the trip? Yeah, like, like go leave. to the airport? What and happened? Really like, upset why me. would they ask you to leave? Like, what did they want you to do? What did they I want you to say I don't think I could have done Bronwyn? anything right. I think unless I was, like, against you, I'm against her. Hi. Hey, what's going on? Getting nice out here? It's getting nicer, still chilly. What's going on? You tell me. I, uh, I walked away from the trip feeling some kind of way about what's going on with Lisa and I. The 10 years we've been together, I've never seen you act the way you acted this weekend. You know, I know we've known Lisa and John for a long time, but for you to sit in a hot tub and Scream back and forth with her is ridiculous. You thought I was screaming? I don't think you were there. I was there. I was I was in the pool, remember? It's my responsibility to work out, no, but when it's I, you and someone else, my ass better you. ride I your dick like it's my you. job. What'd you accomplish? Nothing. Nothing. And you actually, ruined a perfectly nice afternoon. I ruined it?
That's what I think. Okay. I guess you did what you thought was right. I've just never seen you act that way, and frankly, it's not very becoming for you. see why it goes that way like they all yell they all call each other dumb bitches That's they all scream they can do and yell they and i don't I, I don't know how to interact in that scenario leave leave with your dignity todd's approval means a lot to me todd's approval might mean everything to me um so to not only be missing the mark, but be like on a totally different page from the mark, this is incredibly hard for me to hear.